Hey everybody, RC here. Let's go ahead and talk a little bit about Illustrator. Now, this is going to be a 60 second, 70 second tutorial. Just want to talk about a couple of things that I was asked here. Uh, first one was clipping masks. Now, let's go ahead and throw some symbols up here. Let's say, for example, I have a symbol like this and I'll take a sprayer tool and I'll just throw a whole bunch of symbols out here. Doesn't really matter. Notice that some of the symbols are kind of passing the canvas. All right, so everything goes off these edges. Now I wanna be able to kind of trim everything to my document layout. That's what a clipping mask is gonna be used for here. I'm just gonna go ahead and draw a box. I'll go ahead and, it doesn't really matter what color I put onto it. All right, let's just go ahead and do this red, just to kind of show you something. I'll drag this out here, all right. Oh, look at that, didn't even select the red. How dumb am I? I'm gonna go ahead and Single click on this. I'm going to go ahead and hold on the shift key and I'm going to single click on the symbols that sit directly behind it. Just do a right click. Make clipping mask. What it's doing is it's saying take the shape that I have set up and make sure that everything that isn't within the boundaries of that shape gets hidden. So even though you can click out here still and you see that there's a lot more to it, everything else is still hidden within the confines of that shape. Now, the other thing that I wanted to show is text. Take a look at this. All right, so I draw out a box, and there's a box. Now I'm gonna go ahead and paste some text into there. All right, looks pretty good. I'm just gonna go ahead and copy and paste. What if you wanted to be able to make like a multi-column layout right in Illustrator? What you could do is just paste, 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 paste. All right, not bad. Take a look at this. See that little red mark right there? Watch this. This is where it gets awesome. I'm going to go ahead and click on that red mark right there. Once I click on that, you see this little marker here? See that? That's awesome. Watch this. Now all I have to do is just click and drag. Automatically reflows. I want another box. Click it again. Make another box here. Click, drag. Want another box? Well, go ahead and click it again and click and drag. There you go. Now, if you don't believe me, watch this. I'm gonna go ahead and triple click in here to get rid of this paragraph. Watch this paragraph over here adjust itself. Delete. Not bad. Now, if you single click on this, you'll notice that you can still see the flows. It goes from this box to this box, out of this box, into this box. So. Just a couple of different ways to be able to deal with page layout inside of Illustrator. My name is RC. Thanks for watching.